All right, this is video two in the series, and this is a very quick video on how to create a Facebook page. So the first step is on the main uh, Facebook homepage, you just scroll down and go to create page. All right, once on there, I like to pick company, organization, or institution, and then I pick uh, media news publishing. I'm not sure if the category really helps your engagement or your reach, but I just know that some of the other viral sites, most of the other viral sites are all use this category. So if they ain't broke, don't fix it. And uh, just kind of copy. Um, whatever the name is going to be, I don't know what you want to use. I love, I'll just stick with the theme here and go, I love cats. And then go to get started. So ideally when you're creating this page though, for you, this should be your sub niches. So there's not really a sub niche of cats though. I wouldn't ever get that specific where I like orange, orange and white tabbies or I like black cats with white paws. It's just so specific that it wouldn't even be worth doing. But you could do one for, you know, I love hunting or, you know, I don't, I don't know if hunters would want the affirmation I love. I mean, I guess they could, but I mean, you could put something like real men hunt, but then you're, you're kind of uh, segregating only men and I'm sure there's plenty of female hunters out there. Anyway, I'm getting off the point. So you should have your niche by now. Hopefully you have some good sub niches that you can make these pages. Um, just very quickly, just put in a description here. Um, a page for people who love cats. All right. And then if you have your website already, which this video series hasn't taken to that step yet, but you can always come back here and edit it. And this is where you put your website in. Um, I usually always pick uh, yes and yes here, just makes it easier, then you can save the info. And right, then you're going to want to add a profile picture, and that's as easy as going into Google and just finding some cute images of cats, something cute that could be your page. Here's a really adorable one, I'd use that, that thing's really cute. Um, let see if I can just do it like this without actually downloading it. Import from website. Yeah, beautiful. All right, then you can just save that. And you should probably add it to your favorites if you don't, um, especially if you have a lot of pages, it just gets cluttered. You need to find your good ones right away. I just add to favorites. I'm not going to add this one, though, because I'm not going to do anything with this page. Just skip that. And then always skip this step because uh, there's nothing really to promote. You don't want to promote your page like this. Anyway, we're going to, in the next, uh, not this next video, but the one after that, I'm going to talk about. I'm driving uh, traffic with Facebook ads and getting likes and getting your page really uh, going viral. So we'll skip this for now though. And then you want to go in here and add a cover photo. So just try to, the same process, go on Google and look for um, a cover photo that you might like. You can like the page if you want. I don't like all of my pages just because I have a lot of other things I'm doing where I don't want people to reverse engineering me. but. I mean, I'm not that paranoid, so I don't care that much. I usually delete this, or um, I usually hide from the page um, just because it kind of uh, looks like a, it's like, oh, it's a brand new page. You know, he just created it. So I try not to give that a pre impression right away. But the, the Facebook like campaign that we run to get likes with the ads is going to really just drive a ton of likes right off the bat anyway, so it's not going to matter. After a day or two, you're going to have thousands of fans. Um, I think that's really it for making a Facebook page. Pretty simple. So go ahead and do that step. If you have more than one page, hopefully you have sub niches, you can go ahead and create all those pages out and then, you know, add a good profile picture, add the cover photo, and then add them to your, your favorites so you can easily access, the, uh, access them. And you'll be good to go for the next video. I'm going to talk about, all right, getting content on here because first thing you need to do, no one's going to, like a page, well they may, but it's better to have content on here before you start running ads. So if people come to the page, they think, okay, this is an interactive page and they can even have more engagement. So you want to have something here before we start trying to send traffic to it because right now there's nothing here. All right. See you uh, until the next video.